Hello guys, welcome to our project Smart Handset. I am Sunil and this is Sivasis. Here is our description. So hello, I am going to explain what our project was. Uh, we have created a smart, a smart band. Basically what does it do when we meet people in meetings or parties, we, exchange, we uh, introduce ourselves to each other. But it is very difficult to remember who was who. Means uh, the data of every person is not, not easy to remember in our mind. So to ease that we have created a project. So let me explain about this band and what the equipments we have used. We have used this IR LED which is used to send the data. And this is the TSOP receiver which receives the infrared waves. This is the battery. This is Trinket Pro. Basically this can be assumed to be the computer of this whole band. This is the Bluetooth module and this is accelerometer. Now let me explain about the functioning of each of the components of this band. So suppose uh, each band has its own unique ID one of mine and one of his. So when we shake our hands, this accelerometer basically detects the handshake. We have programmed in this Trinket Pro, which is the computer of this band, to in order to detect the handshake whenever we shake our hands in, uh, um, through this accelerometer. So when we shake our hand, this accelerometer detects the handshake. Through this IR, we send the ID. So this IR, uh, this IR sends the ID and the TSOP present in his band receives that ID. Similarly, TSOP present in my band receives the ID which comes from there. So in this way we exchange the ID using IR. Then once the ID is received, this Bluetooth module is paired with my Android app and his Bluetooth module is being paired with his Android app. So this Bluetooth module gets the ID and sends it to the Android app. Now this app automatically sends it to the server. So let me introduce you with our server. So this is our server where we have uploaded all of, our, all of us are, have been upload, have uploaded our data. This is my data corresponding to ID 500 and 500 is my band's, my band's ID also. This is his data 600, uh, with, uh, corresponding to the unique ID 600 and uh, his band's ID is also 600. So we will be exchanging these, uh, these data via handshake. Now let us show the demo of our project. So this is our Android app. Now we'll shake our hands and the IDs will be exchanged. So hopefully the IDs have been exchanged. So now we press uh, receive new and see his data has come to my app and my data has gone to his app which was present over there in the server. Now when we press the button go to list, we can see the list of all those persons whom we have met till now. When we click on it, the data of all those persons can be seen in this app anytime, anywhere you want. So let me show you other features of our Android app. We press the receive new. So now if we want to create a new, new entry in the server, we can do it right from our Android app. So suppose and when we press the submit button. So now let's have a look on our server. Till now, it's still 600 in, 618 ID. When we refresh our server, we get a 619 ID and the data which we filled in our app is present over there in the server. Also, as I told you that uh, my band's ID is 500. So if I want to change any data corresponding to my data in the server, so like I change the description. So when I press the save changes button actually the data corresponding to id 500 will be changed with with the, this data so now let's have a look on our server again and when we refresh our server see this 500 id the data present over here is this so when i refresh our server the data corresponding to 500 id has been changed to what i typed in my android app and in this way we can receive the data of the persons whom we shake our hand and uh, create a new entry over the server when we first install the app in our, uh, in our phone and also we can change our data into in the server anytime anywhere so thank you and this was the project